Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to see how to integrate a video conference in Flutter app. So we are going to use Zigo Cloud because it is best and it is easy to use. You can create your own communication app within a few minutes. So you can read more about UI kits because Zigo Cloud also provides us all the UI kits for any communication app. So this is the biggest benefit of Zico Cloud that provide us APIs and UI kits. So it provide 20 plus UI kits. These are open source, 50 plus components, cross platform ready to use and easy customization. So all these UI kits is provided by Zico Cloud. So first of all you have to sign up. When you sign up for first time you will get 10,000 free minutes that you can use in your communication apps so this is a very simple to sign up and you can create your account but I have already created my account so I will log in so I have logged in to Zigo Cloud and this is the dashboard of Zigo Cloud and go to projects and projects management you can create your new project from here so we will create video conference app so I will click on this and next and give the uh, project name and uh, click on uh, start with UI kits so we are going to use pre-built uh, UI kits of Zico Cloud so click on this so my project is creating So I am going to use it for filter so I will click on this for filter and click on save and start to integrate. So our project is created and we are going to use this app ID and app sign in in our app. So I have already created a project. So First of all, go to pop.dev where we are going to use the Zigo Cloud API, Zigo Cloud UI kits. So, Zigo, and you can see here this is Zigo UI kit pre built video conference. So, we are going to use this package. So, copy this one and add this to popspec.yml. and uh, we have to do some other settings uh, configuration so copy these permissions and uh, put these into android manifest android app src main and android manifest.xml so paste here so these permissions are important otherwise your application will not work and uh, you have to create a file pro guard rules dot pro in a project android and app so this is android app so here we are going to create a pro guard rules dot pro and uh, copy this one and paste here and uh, we have to add this file to in to our build.gradle file this line so go to build.gradle and uh, build of this uh, sign in config paste here and uh, one thing you have to do is uh, change this compiled SDK version to 33 so we have done all the settings now let's create our app so you can create your main file and the home page but uh, we are going to use very easy method that is uh, go to pubspec this is a zigo ui pre-built video conference and from this uh, example you will find the all source code so you can copy this 
and paste here so you don't have to write it and you have to create a file that is utils dot dot and here we are to we will create a class utils and the static enter app id and static string app sign in so go to your zigo cloud dashboard and copy this app id paste here and app sign in paste here so go to your main dot dot and here app id that will come from utils dot app id that we have saved in our utils dot dot file and utils dot app sign in so basically what is going here that here we are creating creating a local user id from random number and uh, here call id group call id so and uh, so here uh, this is our main home page here we are creating a text form text form field and a elevated button so when uh, this uh, when user click on this join button they will join to a conference call and uh, here this is the video conference uh, screen here we are using uh, safe area and zigo ui kit pre-built video conference that widget is provided by zigo cloud package and in in this widget we are going to app id we are using app id app sign in user id that is generating from random numbers and a username and this is a conference id so people will people with the same conference id will be joined in a same conference call and this is a config zigo ui kit pre-built video conference config so we have done our work so let's run this so our app is running and let me change something so i am using this column and uh, button will be below this uh, input id and uh, here i will add border outline line input border so to run this so I am using just random ID and join it so you can see it's working fine you can check it on real devices and it will work fine so as I told you people with the same conference ID will be joined in the same conference call so you can see this is the biggest benefit of Zigo Cloud they provide us APIs and SDK and you can create your own application within a few minutes so you can create your own account in Zigo Cloud and use these APIs and UI kits and create your own application and you when you sign up you will get 10,000 free minutes to use in communication apps so that's all for today thanks